Hey guys, last time on Let's Play Kirby Superstar, we finished up collecting stuff in the big castle area of the Great Offensive Cave. This time, more of the same. Ah, oh, so yeah, I'm really glad to be out of there. That was an obnoxious area. Let's get rid of you. No partners. Okay, uh, another three choices. I think it's more or less the same as last time. So let's go this way first. The stained glass window. What? Hey. What's going on, buddy? Okay, I think somewhere. I think down there we can go. Oh, that's right. Get back up there. I think, yes. There's a treasure here. And if we can grab it, there we go. A charm. What the heck? Looks like. Anyway, I don't know. I don't know what it looks like. Never mind. I needed you, anyway, so, um, alright, so we got some switches here that lead to cannon fire, and we got lots of enemies everywhere, so, let's try this one. One of these, obviously, is right, and one is wrong, that one was wrong. Um, I believe the one that's right is the one that you need to ja get over there? I think this is the right one. Yeah, so you need the jet power to get into this, or the fire power, whichever. Um, alright, so, here, we have a treasure chest and a bunch of blocks. Obviously, don't destroy this one, otherwise you're just gonna lose the treasure. And you have to destroy the one right above it, so you can get in here. And we get, I think it's a Christmas tree? Yep, and, or an Xmas tree. I don't know what that's doing in a treasure chest, but okay. Alright, moving on. Nope, uh, is it? Uh, this, is, this one looks to be blocked off, so I'm thinking there's something in there. Um, okay, I don't, think I don't need you anymore. Get out of here. Out of here, I say. And, what? Okay, again. Anyways, so that switches over here, and run like mad! Alright, made it. I think that, yeah, this is another area. It's, uh, okay, so this is a pretty big little side area here. Um, basically, you can enter to these doors whenever you have these little star things. That means you can get in there, to this area. And, uh, switch, which switch? No, not through the door again. Wrong switch. Okay, try this again. Let's go there. Oh, wrong switch, wrong switch! Okay. Now that's reset. Let's try it again with the right switch this time. There we go. Kong's Barrel. Yeah, that's a pretty obvious reference there. I'm not gonna... I don't think I need to say anything. Uh, alright, so that's done. Let's go up here next. Uh, up here, yes. Good. Okay. Uh, which room is this? Oh, this one. Okay, so basically, just avoid the death from all sides, and that's pretty much it. For our troubles, we get Ramia's scale. Uh, yeah, I'm pretty sure that's a reference to something, but I have absolutely no clue what. So, I don't know. If you guys know, feel free to, like, leave a comment or something, I guess. Uh, anyways. Moving down, and I'm almost dead again. This seems to be a pretty common thing here. Uh, you think I never played this game before or something? False. Anyways, yeah. I don't know why I picked up plasma, I just felt like it. Oh, and look at that. Well, this was convenient. I guess I, I, I honestly wasn't planning for this to happen. But, whatever. I'll take it. Okay, uh, let's fly back up here. Let's go there. I think this guy is next, then down here. We can get, there we go. What do we got in here? Oh, this one. Okay. This might be a little tricky to do with this ability, but I think it can be done. Or maybe not. You know what? Uh, I'm gonna come back with a different ability. And we're back. Turns out, uh, Plasma was the right ability after all. Uh, it wasn't even that tricky. Um, so yeah, all you have to do is charge up to full, like so, and if you get right over to this corner, uh, okay, it's worked 
like two seconds ago, I swear. Yeah, there you go. You just have to be really quick with the fully charged shot, and you'll be able to hit that block up there. Uh, and we get shiny bamboo. I don't know what that's supposed to mean, but okay. So yeah, obviously that's something else that'd be a lot easier if you had like a partner for or whatever, but it's possible to do if you don't. So, uh, alright, moving on. Get uh I guess not. Well, let's just go up here then. Fly. Uh oh, okay. Um I think you need wood wheel for this. I'm assuming since they didn't give it to you like that, yeah. You have to hit the switch. Ah, Okay, so yeah, basically with this, you have to, I think actually, you have to have the wheel partner for this, but you don't actually have to have them controlled, because if you jump on them, obviously now Kirby has an awesome motorcycle, and uh, player one has full control when you're in this mode, I think, unless you have a player two doing stuff. Anyways, if you're just one player and you do this, you will have control, and if you do this, you can actually jump which will get you over here. I get off. No, stop. There we go. And we get a tire. How appropriate. Uh, I'll get rid of you. I don't need you anymore. And let's go down here and make our way back. So yeah, as you've noticed, a lot of the puzzles for these treasures have started to get a lot more complex than what we found in the beginning of just like, here's a treasure, just grab it. Uh, so yeah. It's pretty much going to stay this way for the rest of this play area. Um, but it shouldn't be too bad. What's in here now? Um, okay. There's just a couple... Uh, there might be a treasure in there, I can't remember, so I'm just going to grab a power and do it anyways. I think, though... That was close. Uh, there should be... No, not sleep! Why sleep? Why? Wake up, Kirby. There we go. Okay, anyways. I was trying to get down to this parasol ability here. This should allow us to go where we want to go in that next room. Get back up there. There we go. And if we just go like this. Oh, and all of that for just a couple one ups. Let's just move on then. Uh, I think there's only the one more door that we had. That was close. I, anyway, I think there's this door over here is the last one. Uh, I'm to figure out how we get over to it. There we go. Yeah, those cloud maze things can be really annoying. Oh, it's this area. Okay, so yeah, there's a treasure down here, and you're gonna be these blocks are going to be constantly raining down on you. Ooh, a spirit charm. Probably another reference, but... Anyways, parasol is nice for this because you can protect yourself, for the most part, from getting hit by those blocks and dying. Um, alright, so that should be the last of the treasures in this area, so let's get out of here, shall we? Ooh, warp star rides are fun. Takes us back here. All right, cool. Let's see. That's not what I want to do. This is what I want to do. All right. So yeah, as you can see, we only have a couple more treasures left. Only six more. So we're making. We might be able to get take this place out in this video. I hope. Um, we'll see. I'll try and be quick here. All right. Let's look at this area next. Uh oh. Actually, okay, I think that's the final area, actually. So, I'm going to go over here instead. Yeah, okay. So, let's go... Not that way. Not... Yeah. <sighs> These cans can be annoying to time, right? There we go. Let's see if I can... No! Oh, shoot. That was close. Okay. Treasure! Yeah! Pegasus Wing. Wait, so we've got a unicorn horn and a pegasus wing. Is there some other mythi myth mythical, mystical, whatever thing we're supposed to be getting? And can you fire in the right direction, please? There we go. Thank you. I think if I can get over there, there's another treasure down. Actually, there's
there should be a whole other area down here. If I'm not mistaken. Yeah, this place. This is the last big area, really. Oh, yeah, but I think there's a mini boss down here, yeah. And we have to fight for the treasure down there. Bring it on, Bugsy. You're not gonna stop me from getting that treasure. Maybe you are. Maybe you're not. Ha! Take that! There we go. Alright. Treasure, yeah! And we get a raccoon doll! Another Mario reference, I think. Uh, good thing I left that. This is why I left that maximum tomato up here. Hair. I knew I was gonna get my ass handed to me. For no apparent reason. Yeah, I don't know why I'm doing so bad at things in this. I'm, I swear I'm better at this game than I make it look. Get out of here. Get away from me! Alright, and... A whole bunch of water. How fun. And we get a teacup. Or coffee, I suppose it's supposed to be. Alright. Uh, I'm just picking all of the wrong paths right now. This is fantastic. Shell whistle. Alright. And that Gordo's annihilating me. I think that's. Oh, I kind of need the food right now, so. Oh, that was close. Well, let's just grab this power, why not? Um, yeah, there is that switch over there. I'm not gonna bother with that one up. Yeah, I think I'm actually gonna try and grab nab that crash for this. That's gonna make things a lot easier. Get out of here. Yes, alright, cool. Can we use I guess we can't use crash on the water. There we go. Come on. And yes, made it. Okay. Treasure. Oracle Con. I believe that's a Final Fantasy reference, or probably any RPG reference, really. They're in, like, everything. And that's just down there. Alright, let's move on. Let's get out of here. Almost done. So close. Yeah, if this video is just, like, really close to 15 minutes or something, and since we're almost done with it, I might just, like, cut some stuff out. Or something. I don't know. We'll see. Because I think we should be able to fit the, the rest of this in.